A while back I told you guys that I'd be doing a top 7 list of my favourite episodes of the entire show. So without any further ado... <gasps> Hurricane Fluttershy is my favourite episode of all time and as with all the others I'll explain to you why that is. So Hurricane Fluttershy is a good episode for many reasons, one of which is the first step into Fluttershy overcoming her stage fright, and is in my eyes an entry point into the episode fairly vanilla. I've not yet done a review on Hurricane Fluttershy yet, but if you wait a few months something may turn up and it may just be a collab. We'll have to wait and see. <laughs> Return of Harmony is my second favourite episode of MLP and it's quite simple as to why. This was the first episode involving the antagonist Discord, as he was such a new experience in the show. Being the foil to everything that Equestria stood for, the peace and subsequent order ruined by the sudden appearance of this master or even god of chaos. The episode also does well in reintroducing us to the cast of the show in a small amount of time before they're thrown into a new adventure. <laughs> Party of One was my favourite episode of season 1 for a couple of very good reasons, most notably is Pinky's first episode where she shows a significant amount of depth, and it was in this episode that introduced the fan named character Pink Mina, that being Pinky's real name but being her alter ego. It was fairly entertaining and it's definitely one of the better episodes of season 1. <laughs> I have mentioned this in a past review, but Philly Vanilli is my favourite episode of season 4, most notably it's because it's the best character development for Fluttershy since Hurricane Fluttershy. It may have its problems with that being Pinkie Pie's out of control attitude, which while isn't completely out of character, that doesn't mean I have to like it. Also, Big Mac gets a singing role, and who wouldn't love that? <laughs> Now most of these episodes I've done a review on, and I have done two reviews on this episode, that of which would be Twilight's Kingdom. It was a big bombastic season finale which closed off a couple of story arcs, the Pony of Shadows and most notably the Rainbow Power Box. The DHX staff spared no expense on animation either with a fight scene between T-Rex and Twilight. While this again has its problems what with Celestia's ass backwards decision process and the ridiculous designs of both the Rainbow Power forms and Princess Twilight's new crystalline castle, it's an enjoyable episode, just so long as you don't think about it too much. <laughs> Pinky Pride was a great episode because it was a rare chance to see some depth in a character that has oftentimes never been anything other than a gag character. She shows emotions like doubt, sadness, we actually see how rejection affects her. Offering some continuity from the earlier seasons and episodes like Party of One and later on Mod Pie. The character of Chi Sandwich really added to this episode too and if you're like me and you love Weird Al, this episode can only be good. <laughs> Sonic Rainbow is significant in the same way Party of One was. Rainbow Dash up until this point was a rather flat and uninteresting character, or at least for me anyway. But this episode offered a chance for her to get some much needed depth to her character, showing that she is fallible and her self-centred braggart personality is nothing more than a facade possibly to keep some ponies at a distance. Anyway, that's my list of top 7 favourite MLP episodes. I'll soon be making a 7 worst episodes also, which should be fun. Anyway, if you liked this video, be sure to punch that like button in the face. And if you'd like to see more videos of this calibre, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm the Ponyville Critic and I will speak to you all soon.